armbar to uh, failed armbar to armbar attack. Both sleeves elevate the hip. My hand comes underneath. As it comes underneath, I'm gonna grab the spar elbow, elevate the hip again, pull this across. And like climbing the ladder, I go left, right, left, hand comes up, and I just break his posture. If his posture is broken, my feet can start to move, and that's, not, that's what I'm gonna do. So my left foot comes to the hip, my right foot kicks up to bring his weight forward. So I bring the foot up, I'm gonna pivot and, and pull down. Okay, from there I can push the head open because I have something holding him. I can let go right here, up and over, elevation. Both feet are nice and tight. Now what happens, he starts getting this arm out. Uh, that's a problem. Now I can go homo pilata or just kick over back for a triangle. But for this, since we've already committed to armbar, let's finish him with an armbar. Now, when I hit this, I'm gonna use his body's elevation in order to rotate me. And what I'll feel is I'll feel that elevation. Don't be afraid to go foot to the hip. I'm gonna rotate this knee down, and then I'm gonna kick this foot up and over, and I'm gonna belly down to really make it tight, and I don't let go of this arm. So again, this foot kicks up and over like the arm bar drill. Kick it up and over, and I'll start to rotate and attack. It's real tight. My feet are pulling him in, and my toes are locked. 